Thank you. Um, I, Mr. Schiff, I wanted to ask you another question, if you would consider another friendly amendment. Um, after anti-Semitism, uh, comma, anti-Christian bigotry, and bigotry against all faiths. Uh, uh, I would uh, say to the gentleman that uh, uh, I would be happy to accept an amendment that also um, refers to domestic terrorism motivated by all forms of bigotry, including that against members of any faith. Uh, I don't think we need to sig uh, um, single out one faith in preference to another but I would be happy to accept a modification of your amendment. So are you deleting anti-Semitism and saying all faiths then? Uh, I'm not deleting anti-Semitism because that has been a, a unique scourge which is on the rise. But as I said, uh, uh, unless you want to add anti-Muslim faith and, anti and uh, other religious faiths, uh, I don't think we should single out uh, one to the preference of others. Well, I certainly uh, am, am aware of a number of church shootings. Uh, there are some I'm, I'm uh, aware of shootings uh, of involving Sikhs um, and, and some uh, mosques, but uh, the number of church shootings exceeds those of uh, uh, shootings at other religious f uh, facilities. And so I would just think that it would be important to send a message that uh, anyone who harbors uh, bigotry against Christians because of their faith is every much, every bit as condemned um, and uh, repugnant to those members of Congress as any other faith. Well, I, I agree, it is as repugnant as uh, crimes against other faiths, and I would be happy, as I said, to accept a friendly amendment that includes uh, all faiths. If that is the gentleman's intent, I'm happy to accept it. 